really smaller than a bug because I can't even see if I have germs on my hands. Kids talk a lot. Sometimes you get things wrong. But we learn quick. I'm Kennedy. I'm Natalie. I'm Riley. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Bossig, and I'm about to speak to some TRIO spokeskins about germs. So today, we're going to talk about the common cold. Do you know what that means? Yes, when you're sick. Have you ever had that before? No, I don't think so. so. How about you, Maddie? Have you ever had the colds before? One time, my whole body turned gray. Turned gray? Oh no, you must have been pretty sick then. What do you think causes these colds? Germs. Germs. Bad germs. What do you think germs are? They're little tiny, um, they're little tiny things that, that, have, that have all this nasty stuff in it. And um, if you have germs on your hand, it kind of gets you sick because it's not good for your body. Yeah, they're green. You think they're green? You guys are absolutely all right, you know? They're all different sizes. They can be green too. And um, how small do you think they can be? I bet like, th like smaller than, like really smaller than a bug because I can't even see if I have germs on my hands. I think they're smaller than fleas. Um, they're so t tiny, you, you can't even see them, so you, when you want to see them, you have to use a microscope. Wow. You are correct. You know, they're so small that you can't even see them. They're microscopic. There are several germs. There are types of germs. There are viruses, there's bacteria, there's fungi, there's protozoa. There's some good bacteria, especially there's some germs, bacteria that are in our intestines that help oh, us with our body. Where can you find germs? I think I know yeah. in the bathtub. In the bathtub or in the bathroom in general, right? I, I know a place, but I'm not going to say it. It's the body. Yeah. yeah. After you use the bathroom. Wash your hands. How do you wash your hands? You use soap and water. Soap and water. Bed. So germs can be elsewhere also, not only in your bathroom, but in the air. Mm -hmm. When someone sneezes oh, yeah. or coughs, Achoo, or coughs, it goes into the air. That's why it's very important that you... Cover your mouth. How do you cover your mouth? Do you cover your mouth with your foot? No, <laughs> yes, oh. with your elbow. <laughs> Should you cough or sneeze into your hands? No, 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 yeah. no. That why would just not? get you germs. That's right, because if it goes into our hands and then we go high five, what happens? I'll get germs. If you find some tissue, or some Kleenex, you can use that and sneeze into that, right? How do you protect yourself against the colds or, or oh, being sick? You keep yourself healthy with, with healthy food. Um, you wash your hands after you go to the bathroom and um, you exercise. Hey, we're doing jump of heart. Yeah, that's wonderful. So you made so many excellent points. You eat healthy, so what kind of foods should you eat? Carrots, apples, tomatoes. If there's any germs in your stomach, if you eat healthy food, it, um, it throws the healthy food throws them out. That's right, that's right. It makes your body stronger and healthier, and then you'll feel better in a few days, right? It's usually caused just by a, uh, by a virus, and you'll tend to get better in a few days, about three to five days. That's if you drink lots of water, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yummy, yummy water. Drink Medicine. Drink medicine if you need to. Drink milk. Drink milk if you get plenty of sleep, sleep and rest. But if you're not feeling better after a few days, what should you do? Go to the doctor. When you come over to the doctor's office, the doctor has some special equipment. Who can tell me what this is? Something that you cover your mouth with. Yeah, yeah what so is it if called? If you cough and sneeze or whatever, it's, it's, like um, cough, it's so called a mask. It's called a mask, yeah, that's right. Mask. Especially if you've got the cough or cold and you don't want anyone else getting sick, you can put this on and wrap around like that. And this is kind of fancy here, but... What is it? Oops. This is a thermometer. My nurse uses that for the two only to check your ears. Your nurse used this to check your temperature. And when they check a temperature, it's to see if you have a, what do you have? Fever. Fever, Fever that's right. How about I this? Fever. Oh, I love that thing. 
What is it? It checks your mouth. It, it, it checks. It checks your mouth, you your eat, ears, you and your eyes. Somebody's mouth, and they eat it. <laughs> oh no, no, I don't think so. But you guys are right. I use this, and all the other doctors use this to see if we have any signs of any other problems, what do you use like that for? a sore throat, like large tonsils, or if you have an ear infection, mm -hmm. right? And sometimes we look up the nose as well. Really? Yeah. yeah. Gross. I'll say you guys are all healthy right now, but it's very important that um, when you have colds, okay, and you're feeling sick, that you listen to mom or dad, make sure you drink lots and lots of water, lots of, um, lots of fluids. You wanna get lots of rest. You eat your fruits and vegetables. Try not to spread the germs, right? So ways of not spreading it is to cough or sneeze into your Aww. sleeve. Wear your mask. Wear a mask and always with soap and water. And what is this? Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Sanitizer, sanitizer. Okay. We use that at school sometimes. Okay, who wants some hand sanitizer? I do, I do, I do. Let's get rid of those germs. I stole the Lego germs. Adios. And so when you're when you're not near when you're not near a sink where you can wash your hand and with soap and water. If you guys have a hand sanitizer along, that'll keep your hands clean, right? Okay, so what do you think is the most important thing to keep us from getting sick? Eat vegetables. Eat fruit and be active. Very good. Um, take your vitamins and, and get lots of rest. Very good. And okay, and we have to... Wash, wash our hands. hands. Okay, wash with our soap hands. and water or... Hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. Very good. Good job, guys. You guys are so smart. And maybe later on, um, you can teach your friends about germs, right? Yeah, we can. <laughs>